We're doing some of our heart catheterizations now using a radial approach rather than the traditional uh, approach using the femoral artery in the leg. And the rationale behind uh, moving to this procedure uh, using a radial heart cath or a radial coronary intervention is that there may be uh, less uh, bleeding complications uh, compared to the leg procedure overall. Uh, both procedures are, are safe. The radial uh, cardiac catheterization or coronary intervention approach can be used in patients who are obese and it's difficult to use their le the leg approach. Uh, patients have back problems, they have tr trouble lying flat. Uh, also patients that have lung problems that have difficulty lying flat. It's also a, a, a technique that's useful to use. Uh, patients who have been on blood thinners like Coumadin, sometimes it's useful to use this procedure uh, because there's less risk of bleeding uh, using this small superficial artery in the wrist. Patients like the procedure in that they can get up more quickly and can be discharged home uh, more easily the same day. Um, so it's been accepted by our patients and it's an alternative that many of our doctors are using uh, uh, versus doing the traditional leg approach, doing the heart catheterization and the coronary interventions. Mm -hmm.